It's running up a 1213. Not sure what that is. Something you would find on a farm, no doubt. It wasn't very deep. Okay, moving on. Well, isn't this interesting? It's definitely old. I think it's an old wrench that had a pry bar at the bottom. Wasn't really deep. Probably, let's call it four inches, five inches. Very interesting now. I don't know how old that is. I would like to know. I'll bring that home to my husband because he's a tool collector. He'll figure it out. He'll probably know right off the bat, but that's pretty cool. Okay, moving on. So we got a 23, 24. I don't know what that is. Maybe a clapper for a bell, maybe a croto bell, but it doesn't really look what, like a croto bell, does it? I don't know. It doesn't weigh much. Hang on. That's yeah, empty inside. It's probably a bell. I don't know. That's pretty cool. Hang on again. See, I have a nail in here. I can dig it out with. All right. I took all the goop out. So what is that? There's no writing on it. So I'm guessing it was a bell. That is really cool. Whatever it is. I don't see any markings or drawings or anything else on it. It doesn't weigh much, which is surprising. I thought it would be in metal. All right, we'll try to figure that out. If you know, please tell me at the bottom. Let me just bring that, <clears throat> excuse me, scan that real quick. 2324. Oh, no. A few different numbers. Probably because it'd be in hollow. Interesting, though. Okay, moving on. It's ringing up 13, 14. Not sure what that is either. Maybe the lid or of a tin or covers for some type of machinery. I don't see any markings on it. It's interesting now. Very interesting, these things coming up at the farm. I'm right outside of a old barn. Permission I've had for a couple of years now. It's right around the corner from my house, so I hit it whenever I can. I haven't touched much of it and well I guess that's really all I have to say <laughs> you got a nice big field in the back that's where I was headed and then I figured well you know I've never done the front of this barn there's not much room before the road so I'll keep continuing one of my favorites is ring up a 1617 part of a spoon or a fork I wish the rest of it was there <laughs> it's really cool Didn't ring up very high. I think 16, 17. Probably just plain old stainless. So you can hear the rooster across the street. That's kind of a rooster. <laughs> Maybe that's not a rooster. What the heck is that noise? <laughs> Isn't that pretty though? Look at the design. Very pretty. I don't see a maker's mark on it. I hope the rest of it's in there. I'm going to see if I can find the rest of it. Oops, let's try turning this on. Works a little better. Hope the rest of it's in there, but probably not. Okay, let me give it a quick scan. That ring up is 16. And there was also a nail in there with it. still something down there. I don't know if we can live dig it. I don't have my, I don't feel anything down there, but I don't have my handheld, my long shovel to make digging easier. Let's put this back, that out of the way. Let's see if we can get down in there a little better. Looked like it was about six inches down. So digging isn't going to be real easy here. Oop, found it already. Right about there. 
Probably a nail. But you never know. Oops, bugs. The noceums are out in full force, biting away. Believe it or not, I have a lot of permissions that I have to get to. So many of them, I'm very happy with the amount I have. And I picked up a new one. I think I told you already. Last week when I went out to vote. Okay, it looks like it's a nail or something. Ugh. Okay, that's a nail. So nothing good there. Let's see if we can find anything else in the hole. Ring up pretty high, but nails always ring up so good, don't they? All right, let's keep going. That spoon might be in there, the other part. I'll tell you what, I'm going to get back to you. If I find it, I'll get back to you. Look at the size of this thing. Big, beautiful square nail spike. I know my husband's going to love this one. So I'll definitely keep that for him. How cool is that one? Okay, moving on. All right, I got a wheat penny. First coin of the day. Ring up at 25. All green. Get date off of that. 50 something, 1950. Those seams are brutal today. That's so funny, I don't see anything up to the five. Fifty-two, maybe? It's a D, whatever it is, I see that. Besides much cleaner. Nice, so that's a good score too. So my spoon part, or whatever that might be, a 1950 something D. Should I clean that a little more? Hold on. Two maybe 53 53 there you go 1953 day let's hope that's a key date i doubt it though all right moving on